Protesters took over various roads and streets in the Ibada metropolis, expressing their anger against continual scarcity of narrow notes and petrol. The agitators barricaded major roads, leaving motorists and passengers stranded. Olaido Yewole gives us update. This is coming barely 24 hours after the Central Bank of Nigeria Governor Godwin Emefiele announced that the old Naira note has ceased to be legal tender. Places like Eleyele Rua Road, Iwo Road and Bodija were not left out as angry agitators in their numbers barricaded the major roads, leaving motorists and commuters stranded for hours. They are lamenting over the scarcity and rejection of the old Naira notes. These protesters, mostly traders and owners of small businesses, converge on the state secretariat in Ibadan, lamenting the hardship faced over this policy. Some of them who were seen carrying calabash say they want a total turnaround from what they described as an unbearable situation. Meanwhile, at a security meeting held by service commanders, residents were advised to keep calm Promising efforts are in place to put the situation under control. And of course you can see their feelings, um, which is genuine. But what we want to say is that we don't want hoodlums um, to take advantage of this and turn uh, the state into uh, a place where they will say there is no law and order. Yes, there may be political undertone and all those things, but what the security commanders want to assure the people of your state is that um, the proactive measures they put in place, um, they will continue with it. And I think the proactive measures had helped um, in a very big way. Because if there have not been proactive measures, maybe the situation would have escalated. As Nigerians look forward to the general election come February 25, it is only expected that calm returns to every part of the country to ensure each free exercise. Oladio Yewali, TVC News, Ibadan.